start of a super fun vlog. It's also the start of a very, very busy weekend, but we're on our way to Eric's parents' house right now. It's his mom's birthday on the 8th, and then Mother's Day is the 9th, so we're kind of doing like a big birthday Mother's Day celebration for her tonight. So that'll be fun. His sister and her husband and their little boy came and surprised her, so that was cute. Then tomorrow we're filming my friend Heather's wedding, which is so exciting. We've never filmed a wedding before. It's gonna be our first one. So we're pretty pumped about that. I'm a little nervous just because it's something so different and new than anything we've ever done before, but we're really excited because we've been interested in this for quite a while and knew we wanted to do something like this. So anyway, Heather is letting us film her wedding, which is gonna be fun. That's gonna take up the entire day tomorrow though, like super early in the morning till we'll probably be there pretty late. And then the next day we're packing and traveling for my family's family vacation to Florida. It's gonna be our first family vacation in 13 years so I'm very excited about that. Anyway that's the intro to this vlog just letting you know kind of what's going on since it's very busy this weekend. We just got home from the birthday party and Kara is finishing up the bouquets for the wedding tomorrow. Tiny bouquet. <laughs> it's a boutonniere. So these are the bouquets for the bridesmaids. I have to wrap these in ribbon tonight and my dad this was my dad's idea. He got these, they're like to go on the bottom of a chair leg so the chair doesn't scratch the floor, but like when we chopped the wires off, we didn't want them to be catching on the bridesmaid dresses. So my dad went and bought these to stick on the ends and it's such a good idea. Good morning guys, it is wedding day. We are on our way to Heather's wedding right now. I also just realized I don't have chapstick with me, which is a very big crisis to have when you're gonna be gone the entire day. So I'm literally gonna text my friends and ask them to bring me some. You ready to film your first wedding? I am, I'm You're, excited. Yeah, Eric is so excited. I am too, but I think you might be even more than me. It's us again. We are halfway through filming this wedding. It's 421 right now. We are having so much fun. It's been so fun so far. Hi guys, it is Saturday now, which means packing for vacation day. I've already started <laughs> getting some of Quinn's stuff out. Hi! So these are her swimsuits. I know it seems like a lot. I mean, four swimsuits is kind of a lot, but this one is new that I bought recently. <laughs> That's your sun hat! It's the one I showed a few vlogs ago, and then I got this little tie-dye one from Old Navy because I wanted her to have one with long sleeves for the trip and just for the summer. I'm sure I'll use it a lot when we go swimming at my parents' house. Then my friend Yasmina got her this Minnie Mouse one for her birthday. It's so cute, but I think it might still be a little big for her, so that's why I ended up getting this one too. And I had kind of forgotten that she had this little one from Riley and crew that she got last summer, or from Ruli. It's getting super small though, so it definitely won't fit her all summer, but I'm gonna bring all of them on the trip cuz whatever. I'm just gonna bring them. You have your sun hat on! That's your sun hat! <laughs> yeah! Show us your antennas today. Oh, so pretty! Then I'm also way over packing her clothes, but this is just a little white jacket in case there's like a cooler day or night, which I don't think there will be because I think it's supposed to be in the 90s the whole time we're there. Then these are little outfits, and then these are just some shorts. She's definitely not gonna wear all of this, so I don't know which ones she'll end up wearing, but I mean, her clothes is so tiny, I'm just bringing it all anyway. So I still need to get out like her pajamas and diapers and all that stuff, but these are all the outfit type things I'm bringing. Also guys, Eric just had me open my Mother's Day present from Quinn a little bit ago, and they got me a new tripod because I've been saying for so long that mine's broken. Like, one of the legs would literally just collapse 99% of the time when I would set it up, so they got me a new one. Okay, Quinn is somehow happy, just chilling in her crib right now, kind of. Eric's getting out the pack in place, so we can take that. 
He's also covered in grass because he just mowed the lawn. Oh, am I getting it everywhere? Not really, it's just on your back. Then I do need to wash a few things that are new still. I decided she's just gonna wear this in the plane tomorrow. I mean, we're not gonna be traveling that long. We're just flying to Florida, so it's not super long, but I think it'll be comfortable and I'll have a little blanket with me if she's cold too. This might get rearranged, but for now I'm gonna put in all the diapers and stuff. I got most of her accessory stuff packed. So I have her little sunglasses in here, all of her alligator clip bows. This is just a little pack of rubber bands for her hair. These are her travel size shampoo and conditioner. And no, I don't usually use this brand on Quinn. I know I've heard a million times that it's awful for babies, but for traveling, that's what we have. I have her little bracelets in this and then some socks and her comb for after she has a bath. Then I also added her towel, some wipes, her little vans from Julie, and then some little toys that she can play with in the water. These are fun because they have holes in them and then these you can like fill up with water and then squeeze them out. I did remember a couple more things I wanted to wash because she's in her 12 month onesies now, which is so weird. This looks huge, but I put her in another one of them the other day and it fit her perfectly. So I'm gonna wash these two that I got from Bye Bye Baby. I'll try to link them below. They're so cute and they're a snug fit and she hasn't had any like that before this and I love them on her. I tried to find a link when I bought them but I think they were sold out. So I'll see if they have them again. If not, they have other cute patterns that I'll link. In the rest of this side, I'll need to put like formula and bottles and her vitamins and all that stuff. Then I still need to put her pajamas on this side but most of them are getting washed before before I put them in, but I think that will be mostly everything of Quinn's. This will be our first time flying with her stroller and car seat. Well, it will be our first time flying with her at all, but with her stroller, car seat, pack and play, all that stuff. So hopefully it goes smoothly. I think it will. Hi, your suitcase is all packed. <laughs> Guys, Julie is so nice. She's taking me to get my nails done for the trip. And for Mother's Day. Oh, really? Oh, did I not tell you that? No, I think you just, I don't think you said why actually. I just assumed it was for the trip. Yeah, it's for oh. Mother's Day and for Florida. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> it's taking me to a new place I've never been to. Okay, we just got to the nail place. This is Julie's nails that she got done, was it yesterday? Mm-hmm. So cute, isn't there a butterfly on this one? Oh yeah, there's like half and half butterfly. I haven't decided yet what I'm getting. I'm thinking something yellow, but I don't know yet. I might end up with teal, cause that's my go-to. Good morning guys, and happy Mother's Day. We are on our way to the airport right now. It has been a very stressful morning. <laughs> I'm literally like losing my voice a little at this point from yelling at Eric. <laughs> And he'll probably make me cut this out, maybe not. But basically we left the house early and he was just going, you know, really fast. We did not leave early, what? we left late. We left late. And he was just going a wee fast and I was just, you know, a little worked up about it because it's raining and stuff. So I was literally yelling at the top of my lungs for him to slow down. Now my throat hurts. We just found out that our flight is delayed an hour and we're so happy about it. Well, we were gonna have so much time to kill before we got to our Airbnb anyway, so. Now we have time to stop and actually eat something and feed Quinn and all of the stuff we had planned on doing if we had left on time. I never showed you guys my nails. I got yellow and I love it. Ooh. She did my middle finger super short, which I don't love, but oh well. They look good. They look like sunshine. Yeah. When it's so for nap. I'm gonna feed her when we take off. And she already saw the bottle and actually wants it. Welcome aboard everybody. And yes, this is my day job. <laughs> Welcome aboard everybody.
is that face? We're in Florida. We're finally in the sunshine. Just got a rental car. We technically have two rental cars. So my parents and Mark and Jacqueline are loading up in a different car. Julie's checking out this Jeep for no reason. Asking if we can switch to this instead. Did you do that? It's four o'clock now and we just got to our Airbnb. Finally, it's been the longest travel day, but my family's already in here. So I'll just give a quick tour before we have like all of our stuff in the rooms and everything. Okay, I was gonna do this while Quinn slept for like a few minutes. She was sleeping when we walked in and she hasn't really had a nap pretty much all day. So she's just gonna be a tour guide with me now. So when you walk in the front door, here's the front door. You come in and over here there's like, a, it's like a game room with a pool table. And then you can see over there there's like a dining room table. And if you come straight, there's the kitchen. And then that opens up to the same dining room over there. And then this way there's a living room, a little chair, and some bedrooms over here. Here's one bedroom, here's a bathroom, and then another bedroom. And then this opens up to the pool. <laughs> yeah. It's too dark. My dad just found a mango tree in the front yard and picked a mango. You could probably eat these now when they're not ripe, which this is not really ripe. You know they're ripe when they're purple and red and green and yellow. Oh. Okay, there are four or five Well, isn't that green? Colors. Oh, like multiple colors? Yeah, four or five different colors. But what you do with these, these you can eat like apples. Mmm, like eat the like skin? Apples, typically, no, you peel the skin off. Oh. And then what I always did was I soaked them in vinegar and oil and salt and pepper. Really? Put them in a jar, soak them, and then eat them. Wait, so and that's they're not crunchy. Right yet? Mm. No, I don't think it's My right. dad's from Florida, in case I've never mentioned that. So, so most. Most people don't know you can eat face? mangoes like that when they're not ripe, but you can. So then when you come through here, there's the master bedroom. So this one is super nice. There's bathroom there. And then there's also doors going out to the pool. They have a cute little egg chair there. And then we rented that pontoon that's out there for the week too. So that'll be so fun. We're on like a canal. Okay, we're eating dinner at Ford's Garage, I think it's called. It's the cutest little place. The napkins are literally like, what are these rags called? They're like- Shop rags. Oh, shop rags. They're like for working on a car. And they're wrapped up with hose clamps. All of the waiters are dressed like they're working in like a car shop. Okay, we just got some onion rings. Are these like, is this a part from a car or something? A funnel? It's not a car part. Oh, it's for like oil or something? Oh, cool. It's a funnel. Oh. Oh. Quinn is having her first experience of ranch right now. She keeps dipping her finger in Eric's ranch and licking it. <laughs> that we get for our first night here. It's so perfect. I really want to take a picture of that palm tree with the trees in the background, but the telephone wires ruin it, which yes, as my sister said, that's what Photoshop is for, but I don't really feel like Photoshopping that, so. The sky is just so blue and then the clouds are so pretty. Do you want to go for a skate? Julie's taking her penny board out. Mark and Jacqueline are going out on the kayaks. It's actually about to be eight o'clock. So I'm about to put Quinn down for bed and then I think my mom and I, and maybe somebody else, I don't know, are going to the grocery store to get a bunch of groceries for the week. All of us have been out here by the pool for like the last hour or so. Jacqueline took Quinn in the pool. They went swimming and she loved it. <laughs> She's so tired now. I took out her antennas and her hair is crazy. <laughs> I wish the sunset happened at the back of the house because we'd have a perfect view sitting back here, but it's still pretty in the back. Like, look at these clouds. I already planned out that I'm gonna do either a reel on Instagram or an IGTV, which I've never done either, 
of I think it's gonna be like five baby hairstyles so every morning that we're here I want to film a hairstyle that I do for Quinn I don't know why I thought of doing that I actually had it in mind for so long to do and just haven't done it so I thought I should do it while we're here because it's so cute here and I probably have about five hairstyles that I like regularly go through for her so I think that'll be a fun video to film while we're here we're at the grocery store now getting some things for the week so far we have some drinks that look really good. This is like a blackberry lemonade. Oh, there's the front. This one's blackberry lemonade and then this one's like green tea with honey and ginseng. Got some strawberries, some whole grain pasta that I can make for Quinn sometime this week. Okay guys, I think I'm actually gonna end this vlog here. It was a little bit different than my other pack and travel with me. I've ended them at this point already, but since I haven't yet, I'm just gonna end it now. I hope you enjoyed watching, and up next will be my vlog of our entire trip. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already, if you want to see our family vacation in Florida. And I will see you. I think you can fire it up, can't you? <laughs> in a few uh, no. days with another no. video. Bye, guys. Bye.